Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing my stocking stuffers video. I did this last year on my vlog channel and I did one video for my kids stockings and then one video for my mom's stocking. But in this video I'm going to show you guys both in one video and I just wanted to do something festive, something kind of fun since we have about a week until Christmas. I thought this would be kind of a fun idea so you guys can kind of see what I'm putting in my mom's stocking. We do a stocking swap every single year and it's really fun because we'll usually just sit down and have a glass of wine and then like give each other our stockings. It's really fun. And then obviously I'm a mom, so I have my kids' stockings. So I'm gonna start off with my mom's stockings. I think that'll be really fun for you guys to see. Um, my mom's very like girly, she likes girly things. And so I think I found some good things for her. I probably will put a few more things in here um, before Christmas. I wanna get her a bath bomb. I haven't gotten her a bath bomb yet and I do wanna get one of those at the store. Um, I have a few more ideas, but this is just kind of like what I have now and it's pretty much full, so I feel like I can show you guys. So lucky for my mom, I am a YouTuber and I get a lot of makeup sent to me for free. So I always like raid my stash and I give my mom things from my stash that I have kind of like sitting in my corner of like makeup and stuff. And my mom's a big eyeshadow primer person. I don't usually like eyeshadow primers and I don't really use them. So usually if I get an eyeshadow primer, I'll give it to my mom. And this is the Urban Decay Primer Potion. We all know that this is a very well loved primer potion. Everyone loves this eyeshadow primer. And so I'm gonna give this to my mom. I don't know if she's tried the Urban Decay Primer Potion. She may have in the past, but um, this is always an oldie but a goodie, so I'm gonna give that to her. This one is just kind of funny and random. I like to give my mom things that I really personally like, and the stocking is the perfect place for them. And this is not an expensive item by any means, but it is my favorite eyebrow brush. And they sell this at the Dollar Tree. This is the Wet n Wild Eyebrow Brush. You can also use this for like eyeliner on your top lash line if you wanna like smudge in some black liner. This is the perfect eyebrow brush. I love it so much. And yes, it's only a dollar when you can find it at the Dollar Tree. And it's amazing. I haven't found one that I like better actually. I like it better than the Eco Tools one. And it's just the perfect thickness. It's the perfect stiffness. Everything about this brush is like the best for eyebrows. So I love this so much and it works fantastic and I can't wait to give this to her. So the next thing is these note cards and I saw these at Barnes and Noble and I fell in love with them. She's always told me that thank you cards are so important and she's like a huge advocate for thank you cards but not just like thank you cards for like baby showers and wedding showers but when someone does something really kind and selfless for you um, if you write them a thank you card and send it in the mail, like she says, it just feels good to receive that in the mail. And so she's always told me like, don't hesitate to write them. People like receiving them when it's for something specific that they've done for you or something like that. So I wouldn't say I'm the best at it, but she has always taught me that. I just need to practice it more, I would say. But I got these and they're like a beautiful marble. It kind of looks like an agate. That is what they look like close up. Aren't those beautiful? I absolutely love them. The next thing is the Shea Moisture Hydrating Mud Mask. And I love masks. Masks are always really fun and the Shea Moisture ones are really nice. So I'm putting that in there. So I also got her these earrings and these are by Rachel Zoe. And I love Rachel Zoe's style in general. I just love her style. And my mom likes to wear jewelry, but she's not one of those like gaudy people that wears like really big loud, gaudy jewelry. She likes things a little bit more downplayed, a little more small. She likes gold and silver, but just like very small. So they're very small. They have like a little, it kind of looks like a flower, but not really. It's kind of like a modern looking flower, um, but they're very tiny. These are so my mom. She would love these. This is what they look like close up, if you guys can see. Jill Zoe always has really cute things because she just has good style in general, so I really, really love these. This little wine topper, and my mom drinks a lot of wine, and so she actually bought some Mickey and Minnie wine stoppers in Disneyland, if you guys watch those vlogs, but I thought this would be really cute as well. It's kind of like a snow globe, but it has her initial S for Susie, and you just shake it, and it looks like a little snow globe with like glitter in it. So I thought this would be really fun. You can't have enough wine toppers. I mean, come on. Next is this H2O Oasis Lip Balm, and this is in Rose Petal. It is basically just a lip balm, but it has a very slight pink tint to it, but it's like so subtle, you can't even really tell that it has a pink tint to it, but it just gives you like that very tiny bit of color on your lips. This would honestly be really good for bedtime. It's super, super hydrating, and um, I thought this would be a good addition. Again, a little thing from my stash. So next up, 
I don't know if you guys remember last year I talked about how every year I want to put a can of wine in her stocking um, because I have kind of a theme for my kids stocking which I'll talk about in a second but I couldn't find canned wine this year like last year I found it and I think I could probably find some at World Market but I haven't been to World Market so I decided to do something a little bit different this year but kind of stay on the same theme to a degree um, but I got her a cock and bull ginger beer and if you guys know anything about uh, Moscow mules you will know that this ginger beer is literally the best to make Moscow mules with because it's very 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 gingery and it's not overly sweet so I love this for uh, Moscow mules it's just the best next is her favorite candy which is a payday she loves paydays it's her favorite candy bar so I put one of those in there every year and then I got her this balsamic vinegar and this was so good you know how they have those little like stands sometimes where you can like test out different vinegars and different like oils and stuff like that well this is the crisp anjou pear and it tastes so good this would make the absolute best salad dressing if you mixed it with a little bit of like oil oh my god this would be so 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 good she can dip bread in it I was like actually wanting to buy myself a like bottle of this because it tasted so good at the store so I can't wait to give this to her and maybe like she can make us a salad with it or something next is a little mini spray and play by Big Sexy Hair I've gotten her hooked on this uh, hairspray because you guys know I've been using this ever since I started YouTube I've never changed hairsprays for as long as I've been on YouTube and this stuff is amazing she loves this and she always travels with little baby um, sexy hair hairsprays so I got her a little mini one that she can use to travel with and then I got her a candle from Bath and Body Works and I got her marshmallow fireside if you guys have never smelled the marshmallow fireside it's literally the best Bath and Body Works candle that they have during like the Christmas winter season I love it every single year I have to buy myself a marshmallow fireside because I just love how they smell so much it's not too sweet which I like my mom doesn't love sweet 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 candles I mean it definitely is sweeter but it has a kind of woodsy smell that goes along with it which I really like and so I got her this hopefully she likes it as much as I do it's literally my favorite candle in the world and then I also got her two nail polishes now I don't know if you guys have tried Sally Hansen nail polishes I think they're amazing nail polishes for the drugstore they're always very pigmented I've never had any problems with my Sally Hansen nail polishes so she's not somebody that paints her fingernails she always paints her toenails so she likes to have like bolder colors like some bolder pinks and bolder reds because I feel like you can do that on your toes a little bit easier than on your fingernails so I got her this really pretty kind of like dark pink berry color this is in drop the beat so I think this would be really really pretty on toes I just love that color and then I also got her this this is very much a my mom color this is like a rose a dusty rose kind of a dark mauve and it is in mauve over and I really like this color like this would be pretty on your fingernails or on your toenails let's be honest you can never have enough nail polishes so and then last but not least I shopped my stash and I found this blush that I thought would be perfect for her my mom really likes darker blushes like darker wines and darker kind of rose colors and I felt like this was totally her shade range but in a color that she doesn't have yet so it is the L'Oreal Paradise Enchanted bronzer in, or not bronzer blush in charming and it is this dark kind of terracotta color but it's in her shade range she likes the darker colors but it's more of a warmer terracotta color so I can't wait to give this to her it almost has like a bronzer look to it which I think is kind of cool as well um, but just a little bit more pink so I think she's really really gonna like this actually so I'm excited to give this to her to see if she'll like it obviously I don't use L'Oreal because it's not cruelty free but they have sent me stuff in the past which is why I have this so I thought this would be the perfect thing to give to her so that is it for my mom's stocking like I said I want to get her a bath bomb because I get her a bath bomb every single year but that is about all I'm putting in her stocking this year hopefully she likes everything and I'm gonna show you guys what I got for my girls so for some reason this year I got a lot of candy for my girls I don't know why I think I just started buying things and I wasn't really keeping track of what I was getting and I ended up getting way more candy than I was intending to so I might not even put all this candy in there I think it just kind of happened on accident so um, first I got them these kinder eggs you guys know how much kids love these eggs they're obsessed with them and Elena if you guys remember and watched my vlogs a long time ago you know that she was obsessed with surprise eggs so these have just carried on 
throughout the years and they both absolutely love these. So the next items I picked up were from Justice and these are so cool. I was so excited when I found these. These are little like foam body washes so it's like the same consistency as like shaving cream and my kids love playing with shaving cream in the bath and I thought these would be perfect for them. So this one is Be Perfectly You Cotton Candy Scented and it's like a kitty with like leopard spots on it and this one is You Are Magic strawberry scented and it's like unicorn so the unicorns one is going to Emery because she's my unicorn girl and Elena's my kitty girl so I always kind of do unicorns for Emery and kitties for Elena and from uh what is it called Claire's I found these adorable these are so cute these are uh bath bombs and my girls love bath bombs what kid doesn't love bath bombs I got this kitty one right here with rainbow sunglasses and then this panda one with rainbow ears how cute are these I'm obsessed with these. I get them bath bombs every single year because they love them. And then I picked up these Sour Punch candies. Um, what kid doesn't love Sour Punch candies? Like These are so, so loved by kids. And I got both strawberry and they're just really, really big as well. So it's like really exciting, you know, when you get a big thing of candy. So got that for them. So next up is slime. What kid doesn't get slime in their stocking? It's like such a thing right now, slime. You can get it anywhere, literally. It's like the perfect thing for a stocking. So I got a green one and a pink one and it's just wet, gooey slime. And I think Travis actually got slime as well. So the girls are gonna get like a ton of slime this year for Christmas, but they'll play with it, so whatever. But yeah, it's like alien slime. So if you guys remember last year, I talked about my gift that I'm gonna put in their stockings every single year until they're grown and out of the house and that is soda. And last year I got them orange soda as well. My kids like orange soda, so I got them the Jones's orange soda, and I actually didn't read what was on the front. I just picked them off the thing. This one says, public nudity is prohibited. <laughs> and this one is just some random chick. Like, I should have looked at the, the pictures. Lame. So next is these giant candy canes filled with uh, jelly beans. These are just cute and very Christmassy. And I got these at Dollar Tree, so you know. But I thought these were really cute. These are actually really fun to stick out of the top of the stocking, kind of like, you know how it's like stuffed out of the top. So you know when you're paying for your groceries at the grocery store and they have all of that candy right there at the register and your kids want candy every single time? Well, the kids have their preferences for what I let them get. Usually I'll let them get gum or like Tic Tacs or something like that. And Emery likes to get orange Tic Tacs because she doesn't like gum. So she always gets orange Tic Tacs. And Elena always gets gum. And she likes the watermelon Bubblicious or just this Bubble Yum, like the original Bubble Yum. So I got them those. And then I just got them Ring Pops because Ring Pops are beloved by kids as well. I got them these giant suckers because Every time we see these suckers at a store, they wanna buy them. This is something that we buy sometimes and they'll lick on it for a while and they'll put it in like a cup and then they'll take it out and lick on it for a while. Like they don't eat these in one sitting usually. So I was at Claire's with Elena not too long ago and she was obsessed with this thing and she really, really wanted it, but I didn't buy it for her. She ended up leaving the store with Travis that day and I ended up picking it up for her and just saying, I'll just put it in her stocking since she was like obsessed with it while we were there. And it's this Claire's lip gloss with like a kitty like holder that she could put like on her backpack or something. I don't know. Um, but she was obsessed with this. She wanted it so bad. And so I was like, whatever, I'll just put it in her stocking. But it's like a little purple and pink lip gloss. Elena or Emery hates lip gloss, like any kind of makeup. She like will not put it on her face. So I didn't get one for Emery, but because Elena wanted it, I thought I'd just put it in her stocking. And then two bags of jelly beans. Like I said, I might give some of this candy to my mom. I might put one of these in my mom's stocking. It's the smoothie blend ones. So yeah. I got them both a nail polish because they love to paint their nails. They always want me to, want me to paint their nails. I got Elena this blue one because she likes like this type of thing. And then I got Emery pink because she's still into like that big pink thing. So this is totally their personalities and I think Elena's really gonna like this. Um, Emery usually wants glitter, like that really chunky glitter, but I hate painting glitter on those little tiny nails. So I thought pink would be good enough and she'll still really like this. So that is it you guys. That is everything that I got for my mom and my girls for their stockings. I think that they're really gonna like what they got this year. Let me know what you think is the best items. I think I need a couple more things for my mom's stocking but I think that it is pretty much done. So let me know what you guys think. Stockings are literally my favorite thing to do 
every single year I love stuffing stockings it's so much fun to try to find like fun little things and it's just such a fun thing to do but I always end up spending way more money than I plan on stocking stuffers <laughs> but it's always so much fun and the girls love them you guys see every single year in my vlogs like them undoing their stockings and it's so cute every year so anyways guys that's it I hope you guys like this festive Christmassy video and I will see you guys in my next one bye <music>